हेलो व्यूवर्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन इम्पॉर्टेंट प्रॉब्लम रिलेटेड टू कोपलेनर लाइन्स इन थ्री डायमेंशनल ज्योमेट्री राइट सो हियर वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम डायरेक्टली दैट इज द एल्गोरिथम विच इज यूज टू सॉल्व सच प्रॉब्लम्स बट द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कोपलेनर लाइन्स वी हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दिस कॉन्सेप्ट इन अवर अर्लियर वीडियोज right so here we'll just solve this problem and we'll see the steps how to solve the, such type of problems related to coplanar lines so here uh, we have to find the value of lambda if the lines uh, these two lines are given and uh, these two lines are given to be coplanar and we have to determine uh, the value of lambda for which these two lines are coplanar so here uh, let us quickly see the definition of coplanar lines uh, coplanar lines are those lines which lie on the same plane right suppose this is the plane p and uh, let us denote these two lines by l1 and l2 right so we have uh, uh, two lines l1 and l2 so this is l1 and uh, this is l2 now these two lines are coplanar it means uh, both of uh, these lines lie on the same plane p and let us find the value of lambda for which these two lines are coplanar so here uh, if we uh, compare these two uh, lines uh, with this form that is the standard form of the uh, equation of a line that is x minus x1 over uh, a1 y minus y1 over uh, b1 and uh, this is uh, z minus z1 over c1 right so uh, we'll compare l1 with this line and l2 with this line that is uh, x minus x2 over a2 y minus y2 over b2 and z minus z2 over c2 right so now uh, if we compare l1 with this one we see that this line l1 uh, it passes through the point x1 y1 z1 that is x1 y1 z1 and x1 y1 z1 are given by uh, from this equation so we have uh, minus 3 uh, lambda and 5 right and the direction ratios of uh, this line l1 are a1 Uh, b1 and c1 so uh, comparing it with this one we have minus 3 1 and 5 right so similarly we'll uh, write uh, x2 y2 z2 and a2 b2 c2 for this line l2 so x2 y2 uh, z2 uh, is given by uh, minus uh, lambda here and then we have 2 and 5 right and the direction ratios of l2 are a2 b2 c2 and these are given by minus 1 and we have 2 and 5 right okay so now uh, we have these uh, uh, points that is x1 y1 z1 x2 y2 z2 and the direction ratios a1 b1 c1 a2 b2 c2 so why we have written all these things because uh, if two lines if two lines l1 and l2 which are given in this form are coplanar then the value of the determinant that is x2 minus x1 y2 minus y1 z2 minus z1 a1 b1 c1 a2 b2 c2 is equal to 0 right so this is the condition uh, for the coplanarity of uh, uh, two lines l1 and l2 so this is the condition for uh, coplanarity okay so two lines l1 and l2 are said to be coplanar if the value of this determinant is equal to 0 where l1 and l2 are given in this form so that's why we have written x1 y1 z1 x2 y2 z2 a1 b1 c1 and a2 b2 c2 
now let us substitute these values in this determinant and uh, let us find out the value of lambda so now we have this uh, determinant and uh, x2 minus x1 so x2 minus x1 so we have minus lambda and then minus 3 so this becomes plus 3 because here we have negative sign similarly y2 minus y1 so 2 minus lambda right and then we have uh, uh, 5 minus 5 right that is z2 minus uh, z1 and then we have a1 b1 c1 so we can directly write minus 3 1 5 and a2 b2 c2 uh, minus 1 2 and 5 so now this determinant uh, can also be written as minus lambda plus 3 2 minus lambda 5 minus 5 is 0 we have minus 3 1 5 minus 1 2 5 and now we can expand uh, this determinant along the uh, first row so we have uh, uh, minus lambda plus 3 and then uh, we have 5 1 the 5 minus uh, 2 5 the 10 and then we have minus 2 minus lambda and then this uh, column and this row uh, will be deleted so we have minus uh, uh, 15 and plus 5 right and uh, when we take 0 so this term is uh, here 0 right so now this is 5 minus 10 is minus 5 so we have minus lambda plus 3 uh, minus 5 and here we have uh, 2 minus lambda this is uh, minus 10 and this is equal to uh, 0 right now uh, if we simplify it we get 5 lambda and minus 15 then we have minus uh, uh, here we have minus uh, 10 and 2 so this is minus 20 plus 10 lambda right and this is 5 lambda minus 15 plus 20 minus 10 lambda equal to 0 so 5 lambda and minus 10 lambda is uh, minus 5 lambda and 20 minus 15 uh, is plus 5 right so we have minus 5 lambda is equal to minus 5 so lambda is minus 5 over minus 5 that is 1 right so viewers the value of uh, uh, lambda is 1 uh, for which uh, these two lines l1 and l2 are coplanar and always remember whenever two lines l1 and l2 are given in the symmetrical form then uh, the condition for the coplanarity of the two lines L1 and L2 is given by uh, this determinant is equal to 0, right? So, this is how uh, we solve this problem.